Welcome to a demonstration of the map creation that you can do in Dungeon Full Dive. Let's get started. Dungeon Full Dive offers plenty of templates to help you get started faster, but today I'll be making a map from scratch and letting the assets inspire the encounter. At this point the players are told about a missing group in the forest. No other information is given to them. I need something creepy and ominous to make them slow down and look at their surroundings. Yeah, maybe a giant stone altar will do the trick. Right, I'm just going to put some water feature elements here. Add some plants. Oh, pro tip, uh, the key to creating natural looking grass is just clicking madly. We can't see the forest from the trees because, uh, well, we have no trees. I can place things one by one or edit them in batches. Now I need to come up with the encounter. What is out here? Where is the missing group? I can lay out the campsite, but it still begs the question, where are the campers? Ah, I know. Uh, the campers stumbled into a, a dryad group praying to a demon-eyed watcher lord. Okay, now this is getting good. Now it's time to see what this looks like in character. Time for a full dive. Some of my group will be playing in VR so I want to make sure there's enough for them to experience. And anything I put down is interactable, from food to weapons, everything can be used by my players. Oh, hey, don't mind me, uh, I'm just making sure your uh, sacrificial altar is up to code, don't even worry about it. Okay, gonna change a few things. Uh, let's set the mood. Oh, that's dark and creepy. Now that the map is built, I can let my players take advantage of Dungeon Full Dive's gameplay mechanics. They can make their hero, edit their character sheet, and play in VR or standard tabletop modes. As the GM, I can guide them through unique encounters and make sure no one misses a thing. Dungeon Full Dive gives me the chance to make a role-playing experience like no other. What stories will you tell? 